What's going on people, it's the captain here. Today, I'm gonna to be testing out these beauties, these bad boys, these newly built boy scooters that have been introduced by the government in Birmingham and in and around different areas as well. I'm gonna first of all test it out, and then secondly, I'm gonna do a bit of a review. I'm gonna see uh, the advantages and dis disadvantages of using this. So you ready? Come on then, let's do this. There's a few key things that you need to do before you get on these. The first thing that you need to do is you need to register um, through the app, register your details, uh, add in your bank details as well because um, obviously you get charged through um, your card and then lastly you, you upload uh, your driver's license so they can verify your ID and that and then after that once you're on it then what you need to do is you need to take it off uh, the stand there's a stand right at the bottom you've got the throttle here where it says go as well so you kick off kick off and then uh, you're ready to go then so yeah we're gonna get going then let's do it. yeah I'm on the scooters now man. Oh, these are fast, you know, these are fast. Yeah, they're kind of, they are, you they're nippy, you know, they're proper nippy. All right, you're going to let me go, yeah? All right, nice one. So we're going to go. Go on the roads, see how quick it is on it. This is serious, you know. This is serious. Alright, make sure you've got four feet on it. Got it. Are we going the road? Gonna test it out on the road as well. So it's got different uh, zones that you're allowed to go in but when you check check on your map it's got slow zones it's got um, quick zones and then it's got zones that you, you can't even you can't even go in yeah on the path yo on the path it's much much quicker on the path yeah yeah A number plate as well just like mopeds and just like other vehicles as well so that's a really good feature of it well it's got a light at the back as well and uh, it's also got light at the front as well uh, so if you're riding in, in the night that's really good as well it's got indicators as well so you press the indicator button on the left uh, the right as well it's got indicators on both sides so uh, that way when you're riding on that on the road you can let people know what direction you're going in that's a, that's a really good feature uh, another good feature as well obviously it's got brakes it's got front brakes and back brake as well because obviously those are essential to when you're stopping it's also got a nice stand as well uh, so when, once you're done you, know, you can just park it up uh, at ease and uh, you don't need to fall on that another good feature that it's got as well is it's got a phone holder so you can easily just place your phone in here uh, and you, you know use other apps on your phone as well like google maps or if you want to listen to music along the way that's really good it's also got a bell as well so you just turn that and then the bell comes on as well so you can obviously alert other people that are coming in front of you so that's a really good thing as well those are the sort of features that um, it's got looking at the pros and cons of riding one of these voice scooters. So the pros are number one, it's very cheap for proper short, and I mean short, proper short journeys, like a couple of minutes or three or four minutes. Because in terms of the cost, it costs one pound for five minutes. And that's 20p for a minute, one pound for five minutes. So if you think about it, if you were to ride this on a longer journey, it's gonna cut you a lot of these, an arm and a leg. 
that's number one. Number two, it's also good for the environment. That's why I think the government introduced this sort of user-friendly ride, an, an alternative method of transport. But moving on to the cons, the cons are number one, again, if you go on a long journey, longer journey, it's going to catch you an arm and a leg. I'll tell you that now. And um, number two, uh, me personally, I think the colonic, that's it, it's similar to the Burberry Pacific Council bike, uh, the proper light visible to the eye. If it was a different colour, probably give it a nice, um, better look. Uh, that's, that's about it really, but the major downfall is uh, the cost in a longer journey. So yeah, hopefully Captain will see you on another activity and adventure. Don't forget to share, subscribe, comment and like videos. We'll see you in the future. Then, yeah? For more videos, take care.